All right, so it's uh, it's uh, it's October 12th. Uh, I did the gorillas on the 10th, but um, well, it wasn't enough. And I found out that you could, on a last minute's notice, cross the border from uh, Uganda in the Democratic Republic of Congo and see them again um, on that side of the border. So that's um, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm at the border of uh, Uganda and the uh, and the Congo, formerly Zaire. Um, it should be interesting because this time I'm the only one on this trip. It's just me and the guides or whatever. I'm kind of excited for that, but well, I think this is going to be a little bit of an adventure. Show you where I am right now. Everyone's looking at me and think I'm crazy. So. Crazy shit. I just, uh, as I crossed into the border, across into Congo, we just drove for about, I don't know, an hour and a half over some most ridiculous road, quote unquote, that I've ever seen. Um, and now I'm at the uh, the park station, Park of the Volcanoes, Virunga's Day, whatever. Uh, people in this country don't speak English, they speak French. And actually, there's a big group of military types there. where I am, it's, yeah, this is nuts, good times. sitting here for about a half hour and um, there's some kind of discussion going on and I have learned one thing when traveling in a third world country that uh, usually a discussion's bad I don't know what they're talking about of course I've already you know paid all the money which is 
usually how it works. I even had to pay an extra twenty-five dollars just to bring a video camera. Yeah, I'm sure I'm gonna get that back. So I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Very, maybe they're just waiting. Maybe, I think they have people out looking for the gorillas. That's what I. I'm hoping. That's why we're waiting. Um, I don't know. Okay, good. Huh. <laughs> 